What's up, everybody? This is Fred Rachani of TSC News, here to review Goat Simulator on the PS4. This game is nuts. You play in an open world and the third person, but that's where the comparisons between GTA and Goat Simulator end. You see, you play as a goat, and I ain't talking about greatest of all time. No, 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 you play as an actual goat, the animal. And guess what? He got 99 problems and dying ain't one. It is impossible to die in this game. Now, sometimes you have to respawn when you get stuck in, in some glitch that's apparently intentional in this game because that's, that's the appeal of it. It's almost so bad it's good. But other than that, I mean, you can get hit by a car. You can fly in the air. You can tackle humans. You will face no repercussions for your actions whatsoever. It's like GTA as a goat with a little less room to run around and you don't suffer any consequences. Instead, you get points. You lick something, you get points. You drag a guy by your giant tongue, you get points. You use one of the mutators to turn blue or, use, or, or fly in the air with a jetpack, you get points. Front foot, back foot, points. Getting hit by a car, points. Blowing up a car, points. Running into a yoga studio, points. Breaking into somebody's house, points. Blowing up a car, points. Did I mention that already? You can get points for literally anything. And I repeat, anything. And that is the beauty of this game. Never mind the fact that it is so damn absurd to just play as a freaking goat in the first place. But to be able to cause chaos anywhere you go and not get arrested for it, not get shot at, not get wasted, it's great. Although you might feel like you're wasted when you're uh, riding around as a, as a crazy ass goat. I mean, th this guy's got more eyes than freaking Goku. Even if he had the seven Dragon Balls, he's got more lives than a cat. This man, is, you know, he may be the goat. He may be the greatest of all time in the goat race. That's how badass this goat is that you play at. So, would I recommend this game to you? Let me tell you something. Yes, yes, yes. For 10 bucks or, or 9 bucks if you're a subscriber to PlayStation Plus, this game is absolutely worth it. It might even be cheaper on Steam. It's been around for like a, a year on, on PC. This game is a cult classic for a reason. I wanted to hate this game. I wanted to despise this game. I thought, oh my god, this is a waste of time. This is stupid. But it was so stupid. So silly. So outrageous. It was ridiculously fun. So if you want to have some fun, if you want to blow some steam, if you want to run over some suckers, play Goat Simulator on the PlayStation 4, on the Xbox One, 360, PC, Mac, you name it, Coffee Stain Studios, go find it, go buy it. And if you enjoyed this review, please click the like button. Please share this with all your friends, and please do not forget to subscribe for more video game updates and reviews from TSC News. Until next time, everybody, as always, enjoy the game. And no goats were harmed in the making of this review.